going on, fans? It's to make Dash, and welcome back to Bloons Tower Defense 5. And uh, with, uh, with round 42, the supposedly deadly round, that turned out not to be too terrible, but I did lose some lives. Um, the, uh, that round is over, so let's move on. And I unlocked Grape Shot, so that's good. Hopefully I won't need it. I might need, end up needing to get another one of those things, but it looks like not this round, at least. Ooh, Ninja Monkey unlock unlocked access to Sharp Shurikens. I will take some of those, I guess. Uh, this is a Ninja Monkey. Oh, and he's- oh, and he also has Seeking Shuriken. Infuses balloon hatred into the weapons themselves. They will seek out and pop balloons automatically. Wow. Okay, whoa. Oh, it's the pineapple thing of the Monkey Aces. Which, I, de I definitely- the, the, this map is not good for those, but whatever. Oh, I mean, might as well have some- Whoa, what's with the- Oh, it's because the round ended, so I was like, why did we suddenly go all slow-mo? But it was because the round ended, so Fast Forward got turned off. Okay, it looks like- it looks like the pineapples are sort of doing some work. They're occasionally landing on the- on the track, although it's sort of random anyway, so... It- you know, it's hard to predict. Um... Looks like my Super Monkey's doing some work, so that's good. Need to get some upgrades for him. Is there a... like... oh crap. Uh, yeah, we're gonna need those frozen. Um, let's see. Ooh, laser blasts. Um, and the monkey apprentice. Oh my god, I need him. Let's see, um, I'm gonna need... Let's see, is he... Oh, I, he probably won't have tornado from the start, though. But he needs to be placed near the end, which is, in this case, also the beginning. And let's get ourselves some laser blasts. Um, so... Uh, what was- what was I gonna say? Um, is there anything after- okay, there's still a few more. I wonder if there's some sort of equivalent to the, um... Oh! Oh, we got Moabs in here. Mo- Moab- Blue- Ugh, I can't speak. Moabs, BFBs, and even larger balloons, so there is bigger than BFBs, require hundreds of hits to pop. Luckily, they tend to move quite slowly. If any of these get through, it's game over. So, it's time to deal with some Moabs. Um, probably won't be too big a deal. Looks like it's taking damage quite quickly. Um, so, yeah. Moab is not a problem at this point. Um, so, let's see, building up a bit of a nest egg, are we? Think care about what to spend it on. Money tends to be, get a bit tired the higher they can go in this game, isn't it? Yes, I am aware of that fact. Um, let's see, I was totally gonna say something, and then totally forgot. I have a tendency to do that. Uh, I might as well do it around while I, while I think about it. Uh, oh yes, I was wondering if they're in uh, BTD4. There was a tower called. Um, let's see, oh, we need, we need road spikes. God damn. Okay, we got sharper darts for the monkey ace. Oh, that'll be, that'll be. You know, I'll just upgrade that. Then otherwise, I was gonna build a monkey buccaneer. But um, let's see. Okay. Um, I wonder if there's a uh, equivalent in this game. Oh, I just feel the super monkey looks like Cyclops. I'm kind of like ADD today. It feels. Um, anyway. Uh, I wonder if there's an equivalent to, like, the radio tower from BTD4 in this. But she extended the range and also gave other abilities to any towers within its radius. It didn't do any direct damage to balloons. That was one of my favorite towers in the game. Yes, I have a Super Monkey already. Um, that was one of my favorite towers in the game. And it, it, I haven't seen it yet, but I still do have five towers to unlock. Uh, so, I guess that's good. See, what would be nice is if I could get some upgrades to that Super Monkey. He kind of needs it. Uh, since he's probably going to be carrying the team, uh, pretty soon here. Uh, see, ooh, Missile Launcher. Oh, yes, I will take a Missile Launcher. And Corrosive Glue. Corrosive Glue's good. Arctic Wind for Ice Tower. Super cool ore that slows down balloons that come near the tower. And it did, so, okay, so if it slows them down, doesn't need, if they just go by, it doesn't need to actually freeze them. Ooh, Spy Plane. Allows the Monkey Ace to detect hit can does not grant detection out of the towers. And Super Range for the Super Monkey. And, oh my god, intense magic for the Monkey Apprentice. Holy shit, I got a lot of shit. <laughs> um, Monkey Village does not attack balloons, but instead lowers cost of all towers and upgrades in the radius by 10%. Has many useful upgrades that help nearby towers. Okay, so that's probably the equivalent of... The radio tower. I was actually hoping it would be the equivalent of the, more like a banana plantation, uh, which gives you money um, each round. But which is uh, one of my other favorite towers. I really like the economic tower, so I, I guess I'll put this here. Uh, that's probably going to be where it's going to have the most effect. 
So what what does it do on upgraded? It uh, it lowers cost. Okay, that won't be a huge deal at this point. Uh, first, I'm going to unlock some other upgrades. Um, that I just since I got a lot of upgrades there. Um, so ooh, that's pretty expensive. Um, I can't afford a second one. So we're getting to the point where I'm going to have to start saving some money. Um, for the uh. For the uh, oh god, a molem. This is round 50, so it's so the end of sort of the actual level, so to speak. Uh, I'm starting to get a bit of lag, but that usually happens when you get into higher levels. Maybe not quite this early, but um, let's see. Oh crap, I may need some most, but no. Okay, monkey book in here got some cans. I achieved, I got lobby bronze. Um, that's probably for getting completing it on easy. Yeah. I've been awarded $75 monkey money for defending the monkey kingdom. See, I'm going to keep playing in free play mode. Uh, this is free play mode, keep playing as long as you can. You can't save your game in free play mode, and you get XP more slowly in this mode. Some rounds start to get pretty heavy later on, so your computer will probably start to lag quite a bit. Good luck, thanks. Oh, so you can't save? Oh shit. So, that means I'm going to have to do this all in one session. Uh, why is nobody moving? Um... See, alright, I guess I'll buy this. I think I unlocked a bunch of other shit, too. Oh, it was, uh, it was Monkey Monkey here had longer cannons. Oh, and Missile Launcher. Forgot about that. Uh, why are, why aren't my, um, Monkey Aces moving? Um, they, oh, I probably should have placed one of those near, oh well. Um, anyway, well, let's continue. So now I'm not going to be able to save my game. I can still divide it up in, in the different episodes, but it's going to have to be, um, it's going to have to be, uh, sort of, you know, I'm not going to be able to close my browser and Ninja Monkey Distraction. Some loons will, struck by the ninja's weapons will become distracted and move the wrong way temporarily. Huh. That could actually be bad. That, um, because of how the how it's near the entrance which is also the exit I would have to hope that okay monkey beacon okay so that's um so that's that upgrade so I'm going to definitely want that uh, the thing with this is will it if they go back all the way through the entrance will it count them as escaping and eh, what the hell I'll just buy it I don't really I mean I got up to rank uh, say say uh, 15 which is what I, which I only needed to get to 10. So, okay, so now I have a, uh, monkey, a monkey, uh, beacon here. So I think I'm going to start, um, putting, see, I won't need one of, actually, yeah, so I'll put, I'll just start placing those everywhere, um, to sort of help the range of my towers and upgrade abilities. So, that covers all these ones. I'll need another one for... Oh, I don't have enough for another one. Okay, I'll make another one. Um, after this round, I guess. If, assuming I get enough money, which I probably will. Um, it'd be nice if I could... See, you earn more XP slowly in free play. But, whatever. I don't particularly care. Um, see, what did I just see a bunch of balloons go flying up this way? Maybe that was the distraction. Ooh, my ice tower leveled up. See, so creates razor sharp pieces of ice on frozen balloons that will pop, fly out, and pop near more nearby balloons. Oh, I got a banana farm, thank god. Um, so, wait, okay, so, when your farm produces the bananas, collect them by moving your mouse over them. Oh, so it's not passive anymore? That sucks. Okay. Well, uh, I'm gonna put it over here. Uh, so I have banana farm. These farms generate bananas automatically during each round. Convert the bananas into cash by mousing over the bananas. The only two long bananas will spoil after 10 seconds if not collected. So I have to ju I'll just keep my mouse over it and only worry about well, worry about spikes if I need to. Um, so what else can I do? Um, let's see, that's unlocked at rank 26. Uh, let's see, viral. For, um, I thought I unlocked something for these. Unlocked at rank 26. Viral frost. So, huh. Oh. Okay, so you can only do level 3 and 4 upgrades for one path in this. Okay, it used to be that you could do all of them. Okay, that's kind of bullshit. Wow, the thing still only has 225 pops. It's probably one of the worst towers in the game, actually, but whatever. 
Um, so because of that, so I unlocked in level three for um, for the, this tier and because I already bought the level three for this tier, I can't get it. Oh well, um, I'll get it, I'll get it in another game. Um, so in that case, I'll just continue putting monkey villages everywhere and uh, see place one there, but I can't afford the monkey beacon ability. Oh well. So, let me, so I'm just gonna leave my mouse over here. And, and, but watch the, sort of keep an eye on both. Okay, yeah, it'll automatically pick them up. I'll just keep an eye on the track. Just so, um, just so I can, uh, get the, uh, use road spikes if necessary. So, that's, that kind of sucks that it's not it used to just be that you get more cash per each round. Uh, it wouldn't be like you have to hold your mouse over it. So that's kind of bullshit, but whatever. Um, let's see, let's put these away. Um, and buy this. And I don't have enough for another one. I'll probably see. I don't think the, um, the range upgrades will be necessary for the monkey aces or the cyber monkey. So I'll just put a monkey village next to all those for upgrade purposes but not a um oh my, I should do this um but not a um but not upgrade it to a monkey beacon um so yeah okay I see what it means but they're going the wrong way it doesn't still look like I lose it look like I lose lives for it though so ooh super monkey I got plasma blast okay and fireball for the apprentice and the monkey fort for the monkey village. Okay, increases the popping power of all nearby towers by one. Okay, I think I'm going to get that for uh, for all these. And uh, how much are the plasma blasts? Thirty-eight twenty-five. Okay, uh, I'll save up for plasma blasts then. And then see, money is become is starting to become a problem. Like I said in the in the first video, that it would be and. Uh, yeah, it's becoming more of a problem than unlocking things. Um, so, yeah, see, if you guys could destroy that Moab, that'd be great. Um, see, ooh, I got a spike pulp. Uh, see, it, it's a powerful tower that hurdles large spike ball instead of darts. Good range, but slower attacks, but each ball can pop up to 18 balloons. I'm gonna get that. Tax spray, spray out 16 tax, and then, let's see, jungle drums. Um, inspire the nearby towers to attack faster, increasing attack rate by 15%. I'm gonna get that, um, and I'm, then I'm going to be poor again. See, how much is the spike pull? I'll just get that. Um, uh, and I, so that upgrade path is now closed because I bought it. Um, but, oh well. Might as well get this too. And then I'm completely broke again. Oh, I need to keep my mouse over here, probably. That, I should probably do that, um, to get more stuff. So, ooh, that sounds cool. Um, so, uh, what was I, what was I gonna say? Uh, let's see, ooh, I got Glue Gunner. Nice. And more bananas, grow six minutes each round instead of four. Okay, so I'll buy that. As well as, uh, the Glue Gunner upgrade. Uh, oh, I can't afford it. God damn. Uh, so yeah, money is definitely becoming a problem. Um, but fortunately, it looks like the towers I have are, um, oh crap, um, it looks like the towers I have are, uh, taking care of the balloons quite nicely. I'm not losing any lives or anything, so I don't need to be paying for road spikes or ex extraneous, um, upgrades. See, three times faster and viral frost. Blues. Okay, so we read about those. They freeze other balloons that come to contact them, spreading the freeze like a virus. And I unlock Mortar Tower. Okay, uh, I'm definitely I'm going to get one of those. Because uh, it's it basically, you can just put it right here and tell it to attack the beginning of the map. Um, so, Viral Frost is unlocked at rank 26. So, I guess that means I have to be rank 26 to use it? Okay, whatever. Money I don't have to spend on something else. Okay, so... I can't afford either of these. They're both level 3 upgrades, so I ha I'll have to choose. Um, out of Deadly Precision, which extreme accuracy and muzzle velocity So, up to 18 layers of balloon to be popped per shot, enough to destroy an entire ceramic balloon. 
I don't think I quite need that. I think uh, three times faster is going to be better, and it's also cheaper. Um, see, I'll purchase some jungle drums. Um, and yeah, all right, that's all I can do for now. Um, so let's keep the mouse over here. I'm definitely going to need that thing to start pumping, start delivering faster. Um, but and and also this means you can't really have multiple of them like you could in. Uh, and BGD4, uh, not as easily at least. Um, well, I have enough for play. Oh, oh, I thought some were ex escaping there. Crow's nest allows it to detect camera, detect camera blends. That's not as a huge deal. Monkey Village radar scanner allows all towers to. Detect so that's not really. A, those aren't really a big deal. I think I'm gonna get. Oh, I still can't afford it. Oh well, I'll get this instead. Um. So hopefully I'll be able to afford it next round, and then I'll I'll start focusing on oh shit right, and then I'll start worrying about the uh, the camo bloom uh, upgrades. Those are, those aren't nearly as big of a deal though. So ooh never never miss targeting darts seek out and po oh I could use that. Uh, I still I still I came in with exactly as much money as I did last round I think. I'll definitely get never miss targeting though. Um, and now I have two dollars. Um, <laughs> see, oh, that's a BFB. It kind of looks like Spider-Man at first, actually. Uh, see, I'll get myself some, some, uh, darts out. So yeah, those things contain four Moabs within them. I'm, my, uh, so, okay. I was going to say my, um, road spikes maybe needed, but n they weren't. Glaive Ricochet. The glaives from this tower will automatically bounce from Lincoln Bloom as long as there's one close by. Ooh. That can, would be useful, but I can't afford it. Wow, I'm poor. Probably because BFBs don't give you a whole lot of money. Um, actually, I just realized that, uh, it's round, let's see, that was round 60, so I'm done with round 60. And I think it's also been about 15 minutes, I think? I stopped keeping track a while ago. I probably should have been. So I'm going to end the video there. Uh, I'll make a dash in the mouth.